Hello, and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the 7th grade concept of solving rate problems. This is standard 7.4D in the great state of Texas, and we are using item number 14 off the 2017 released star test. If you have not done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and then we will look at our answers together. So, we have the price of a video game, and it is being reduced from $60 down to $45, so that's a nice sale, but we need to turn that into a percentage. All right, so there's two different ways that we can solve this. First, let's take our original price. So that's 60 bucks. And then let's take our new price. And that's 45 bucks. And let's subtract. Let's see what the sale was, right? So the sale is going to be $15 off. All right, so we took $15 off. And if you want to find the percentage that it was reduced, well, that's a pretty simple way of you make a fraction of your sale price over the original. So our sale price was $15, and we took $15 off an original 60. So we can actually divide both by 15, right? And that is going to get you one-fourth. And then we just need to know that one-fourth is equal to 0 0.25. It's a quarter, we're 25 cents. So that's going to equal 25%. So that's going to get us G. Now, what's the other way to solve this? If you don't want to remember all that, well, think of our equation for rate change. Y equals KX, right? So X is going to be our independent variable. So that's what we're starting with. So in this case, our independent variable is what we're starting with. It's going to be that 60 bucks. Our K Right, that's going to be our constant of proportionality. That's our rate change. So we're going to multiply it by K. And I'm just going to use the commutative property to kind of flip the K and the X. So it's X first and then the K second. Y is our dependent variable. So this changes, Y changes based on what we do with K. And in this case, it changed down to 45 bucks. So we started with 60, multiplied it by something, got it down to 45. So obviously it's going to be less than 1 because we're making it smaller. How do we isolate that K? Well, we just divide both sides by 60. And what we ended up doing was just dividing both sides by our independent variable X. And look at this. K equals YX. That's an equation that's on your mathematics chart as how to find the constant of proportionality. So let me rewrite this here. K equals 45 over 60. Let's divide that by 15s. So 45 divided by 5, 3 times. 60 divided by 15, there we go. 4 times. So our K or our constant was 3 quarters or 0 0.7 or 75%. Now, here's the thing. Our original price was 60. And so if we want to think of it in four chunks, right, the new price is 75% of it. Here's my new price. And we already know that's 45, right? But the question is not how much of the original price is remaining. The question is, how much was the price reduced? And that's this little guy right here. So how much was it reduced? It was reduced this $15, or it was reduced 25%. Since that 45 makes that 75%, here's what we need to do. When we get to this point right here, we need to take our 75 off, and we need to subtract it from one hole, because that one hole is the same as 100%. What we get there is we get our answer of 0.25 or 25% G.